Hi friends! Today we are going to talk about rainbows. And yeah, don't forget our channel's name. It's Aha! And my name is Anika. And, and my name is Anika. So today we are going to talk about rainbows. As I already said. So, wait, what is a rainbow and why does it have so many colors? We are going to dig in about it. Mm-hmm. 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 So, you want to dig in a rainbow? No. no I don't I. want to. Because if, if we dig a rainbow, it will go away. Wait. Nothing else. If you go. Wait, look at this. It has a rainbow tail. And I want to tell you something. If we go near a rainbow, the rainbow disappears. Mm, wait, how does that happen? Oh, Panchika. Look, a rainbow is landing on that house. <gasps> oh, yeah. I see it, it's right there, and I like it. It's so beautiful, and it has so bright colors. Like and this. Yep, this has magenta, pink, and pink. And those are the different colors we do not we do not want. But so, we need red in it. Yeah, we don't want pink or magenta, we want red in it. So, Hanshika, what do you think? A rainbow is formed, like, or did you wonder what a rainbow is? Who lives on it? I wonder who is on it. Wait, nobody can be on it. Yes, he can. This can be on it. Because, do you know, on the rainbow, it's unicorn on it. Unicorn land on rainbow? Unicorn house on rainbow? I don't think so. Because this season has wings and it can't fly to the rainbow. Yeah, but I have the other and it has so many wings in it. It has only two wings. Those are not too many wings. Did you ever wonder what a rainbow is and how is it formed? Um, I think it's formed from the sun and the rain because the sun is right there and the rain is right there. With the or clouds. you can just say the clouds and sun over there. Yeah. This the is my clouds. And, and this, uh, this is the sun, and it reflects right on the crown cloud. And look at these nail pins. These nail pins are the raindrops, and the raindrops are so many types of color. And the sun reflects on it, and then the, rain the colors go out and become a rainbow, like this unicorn tail. Ma, ma, ma. Yep, you are unicorn. So. This is the child version. This is the first grade version of it. Now let's see the fourth grade version of it. Ha! Let's see. Fourth grade version. You don't even know what that is. Hmm. How is a rainbow formed? Usually, all light waves blend together to form white light. But when light waves pass through raindrops, they separate. This happens because the raindrops blend light waves with different light wavelengths by a different amount. The separated light waves appear as the colors of the rainbow. That's the fourth grade version of it. That's eight, but that's four. Yep, that's the fourth grade version of it. So, so that technically means like make a sun over here. This is the uh. sun. This horn is over here the sun oh yeah this over here the horn is the sun and this body it's the cloud and this is the rainbow fancy rainbow so what it's not wait 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 it goes the sun the sun like the sun waves go the sunlight goes in the cloud and the cloud has so many raindrops those blend together like that and then there's a super color, superior color. So that color just forms out of the cloud. Yep, that's the definition of a rainbow. What are you doing? Okay, that's the definition of a rainbow. And yeah, remember to tell your parents, or parents remember to tell it to your kids. And don't forget to surprise them. And yeah, by and, this knowledge. And Thank you for watching this video. Bye. Bye.